Welcome back to the AI Breakdown. Today, we are looking at the collective intelligence around possible AI futures. Now, one of the things that's interesting about the artificial intelligence space is just how contentious, well, everything about it is. You have debates around policy, debates around safety questions, debates around technology, and all of that is happening in an incredibly fast-moving, fast-evolving context. Given that, it's very hard for any one person to know exactly how things are likely to proceed or what's likely to happen next. And in fact, one of the things that makes some people nervous about the development of the field is how bad experts have been, historically speaking, at predicting how quickly developments would happen. In other words, people by and large thought it was going to take a lot longer to get to the GPT-4 level intelligence that we're at than it actually took. So, of course, when the predictions of experts start to fail, an alternative approach is to look at collective intelligence. One really interesting resource for that is Metaculus. Metaculus calls themselves a forecasting platform that optimally aggregates quantitative predictions of future events. And earlier this week, the AI Safety Memes account posted a number of really interesting Metaculus prediction markets around AI. So what we're going to do today is head on over to Metaculus and look at some of the more interesting questions. Let's look at an AI business prediction market to get a sense for how the platform works. So the question, which was opened on April 19th, 2023, was will an Elon Musk funded AI lab release an LLM before 2024? As part of the prediction market, there's a section that articulates the resolution criteria. In this case, they write, this question will resolve as yes, if an AI lab which receives funding from Elon Musk releases a large language model at any time between April 1st, 2023 and January 1st, 2024. A model will be considered released if a general member of the public can access the model either through a paid subscription, a waitlist, or through immediate free access. There are no requirements on the amount of funding Elon Musk provides to the lab so long as the information is public and not disputed by either Musk or the AI lab. Anyways, the point is not the details of this particular question, but that when a market is opened up, there are very, very specific resolution criteria that are included. Metaculus also has a section for background info to help people get a little bit more information. And then when you make a prediction, it's not necessarily a binary yes or no, but a probability distribution scale where you can say 1%, i.e. least likely, 99%, i.e. most likely, or anything in between. The chart at the top shows the results over time, including the aggregate prediction, as well as the total number of forecasters. So for example, on July 13th, there were 66 total forecasters, and the community predicted a 32% chance that an Elon Musk-funded AI lab would release an LLM before 2024. Just a couple days later, that had jumped to 50%. Perhaps not surprisingly, that number went up after XAI was announced formally. Okay, so that gives you a sense of how this works. Now, Metaculus has a number of different buckets into which their prediction markets fit around AI. Those include AGI outcomes, regulation of AI, AI safety, AI demonstrations, business of AI, public perception of AI, AI in China, AI technical benchmarks, and public figure forecasts. I'm going to mostly skip over the AI technical benchmark section because it is, well, the most technical. It includes questions like, will transformer-derived architectures accelerate progress in deep learning? How many billions of parameters will the largest machine learning model trained before 2030 have? Will OpenAI release an LLM product or API that hallucinates 5x less than GPT-4 did when it was released by June 30th, 2025? Let's instead jump into the public perception of AI. And let's try to go to some of the most active conversations. One question that I think is interesting is, will AI be meaningfully discussed by both candidates in the 2024 U.S. presidential debate? The resolution criteria says that the question resolves yes if both Democratic and Republican candidates say at least two sentences largely about AI during the official 2024 presidential debates and otherwise resolves as no. Right now, the community thinks there is a 73% chance of that. Now, one big question is, of course, whether debates are actually held, as they've sort of been on the chopping block for the last few years. But nevertheless, assuming that they are, 73% of people think that AI will be a meaningful conversation point. Here's one that's pretty interesting and pretty far out there. When will most Americans personally know someone who has dated an AI? The weighted predictions of the community have this happening on April 6th, 2034. So basically 11 years from now, most Americans will personally know someone who has dated an AI. Now this also shows one other interesting feature of this platform, which is that over here on the right, you can see news that relates to the prediction market, such as CNN's recent piece, Modern Romance, Falling in Love with AI. Let's move over into the business of AI section. 
A lot of these have to do with competition in the AI space. For example, will Bing's search engine market share be at least 5% in March of 2024? For reference, their market share was around 3% in 2022. Only 7% of users predicted that it would. Meanwhile, when asked what the search engine market share of Bing will be in December of this year, the average prediction was 3.274%, which is a very small jump up from the 3.0% or so that it was last year. Another one about the arms race, when will Google DeepMind's Gemini model be publicly released? The average prediction is January 4th, 2024. Now, DeepMind's Demi Sasabis has said that this model kicks the slats out of ChatGPT's GPT-4, basically, so there's a fair bit of excitement around seeing what it can actually do. Related, when will OpenAI announce GPT-5? This is one of the more participated prediction markets around AI on Metaculus, and right now the aggregate answer is December 13th, 2024. Now, this one's interesting because there is not only a technical dimension to this, but also, obviously, a political dimension. I believe, and I think many others do as well, that it would be extremely problematic for OpenAI to announce GPT-5 right now, given big unanswered questions about policy approaches to highly powerful LLMs in the future. Speaking of policy and regulation, there are a lot of active markets around these questions. For example, will the U.S. place restrictions on the total compute capacity individuals or companies are allowed to have before 2026? People give this one very low odds, just 3% think the U.S. will. On the other end of the spectrum, on the question, before 2025, will laws be in place requiring that AI systems that emulate humans must reveal to people that they are AI? The community prediction is a 75% chance that yes, they will. Here's another interesting one. Will a member of the United States Congress introduce legislation limiting the use of LLMs before January 1st, 2024? The community gives a prediction of a 64% chance of that. By the way, going back to that compute capacity question, if you zoom out to 2050, the community gives it a 39% chance that the United States will place restrictions on compute capacity eventually. There is also a ton of activity around the AI safety bucket. You remember that just a few weeks ago, OpenAI announced their super alignment initiative. This is a sort of moonshot challenge to solve the core technical challenges of super intelligence alignment within the next four years. Of course, this made it to a prediction market. Will OpenAI announce that it has solved the core technical challenges of superintelligence alignment by June 30th, 2027? The community prediction ascribes that just a 9% chance. On the flip side, question, in 2023, will a successful deepfake attempt causing real damage make the front page of a major news source? That one's at 86% chance of happening. Another slightly nerve-wracking one. Before 2032, will we see an event precipitated by AI malfunction that causes at least 100 deaths or at least $1 billion in economic damage? This one has actually opened all the way back in September of 2021 and has more or less been steadily increasing throughout that time. For much of 2022, the community prediction had between 50 and 60% odds of this happening, but now that number is up to 85%. And finally, let's close on AGI itself. Will there be human-machine intelligence parity between 2040? This is one of the older questions on the platform being opened on December 1st, 2016. Interestingly, the forecast started high. In the first few months after the prediction market was created, the community ascribed between a 60 and 80% chance of this, although they went down between the end of 2017 and the end of 2018. In November 2018, for example, 295 forecasters had a 35% chance that there would be human-machine intelligence parity before 2040. Over the course of 2020 and 2021, that ebbed and flowed, getting all the way back up to around 60% chance, before in early 2022 coming all the way back down to 32%. Over the course of 2022, however, that did nothing but increase. And after ChatGPT was released at the end of the year, the predictions went through the roof. With over 2,000 predictions, the community now ascribes it a 92% chance. But what about when? Well, there's a question, when will the first general AI system be devised, tested, and publicly announced? The resolution criteria goes deep in terms of what this actually means, but effectively it's the when to the answer of that question that we just discussed of human-machine intelligence parity. The weighted community prediction has it happening on July 6th, 2032, so around nine years away. There's also an interesting question comparing the relationship between weak AGIs and superintelligent AIs, asking after a weak AGI is created, how many months will it be before the first superintelligent AI is created, where the community is predicting 42.47 months. In other words, around three and a half years. So the point of all of this is obviously not to treat these predictions as definitive. And frankly, it's not even really to look at them as static predictions. What's far more interesting is to understand how things change over time and how new news influences or shapes or changes the story those prediction markets are telling us. Ultimately, 
Resources like this are all about helping us get a pulse on an incredibly fast-moving technology that is also going to have huge impacts on economy and society. If you want to go play around yourself, you can go to metaculus.com, that's M-E-T-A-C-U-L-U-S.com, and it won't be hard for you to find AI, but if you want to just do slash AI, that will get you to this section as well. Anyways, guys, hope this was interesting, and of course, let me know what your predictions are in the comments. Thanks as always for hanging out, and until next time, peace.